height that I always wanted to be oh, well, as a thank little you, girl. My friend. Jane uh, DeNoble is this fantastic friend of ours here at QVC because she has all these space saving uh, ideas for our homes. Not only space saving, but ways to really spruce them up. Give them a magical makeover without having to spend a lot of money. And if you've been wishing for a makeover for your bathroom, here's her quickest, easiest, best way to do so. It's with just simply changing your shower curtain, but instead of buying all kinds of different parts for yeah. it, we've got everything you need with the hookless plaid jacquard style three in one shower curtain. This is the hooks, the curtain, the liner, it all in six colors at $10 off because it's on clearance this morning. And love it. We love it. I love it as a decorating tool. I love it to use it because it's so easy. I mean, when I first bought my house, I had two bathrooms. Mm -hmm. So I had to buy a shower curtain, yep. the liner, the hooks, big purchase times two. It mm -hmm. added up. And then putting it all together, trying to thread the liner and the shower curtain through that hook yeah. and then standing up on either the toilet seat or a wobbly chair and putting Not it up easy. was always a, a yeah. fright in its own so self. Then I found hookless. Now, hookless has these little C-shaped rings that go right over your existing shower rod. I love that they're they're plastic. That means they're not going to rust. I mean, and they so don't many... make a lot of noise oh, when you're opening up that shower good curtain. Good point. Yeah. And then we have this window panel. This is great, especially if you don't have light in your shower. Mm -hmm. So it lets the light in, lets the steam out. So a really great idea. And you don't get freaked out when you're in the shower. Well, for me, it's a modesty coverage because with uh, mama, two boys, five and nine, I never take a shower alone because I'm in there and somebody's coming in and some big emergency because they can't find a pencil or a toy. When they rust in there, they're not seeing me and, you know, what yeah, they mama see gave here, me. Yeah. But they don't see you. Yeah. <laughs> so, and then we have the liner is here. It has a nice little frost to it, uh -huh. so it hides the soap. And it's easy to clean. In fact, the curtain is machine washable. Mm, and I like how soft the liner is. It's had that hard, Yeah, you know what? Big, and that's why I say, plastic. I mean, think about your curtain right now. Is it heavy plastic yeah. that accumulates all that soap scum? This is lightweight, easy way to redo your bathroom. Especially with all these colors. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's talk the yeah. colors here. This is pale blue. Now, this is your turquoise family. Next, we have the white. This is a true white that's sometimes hard to find. So I love that. Mm -hmm. Now, if your tub is in the almond family like this, go with the vanilla. Mm. It brings out like the yellow in it. It is mm -hmm. really fresh, really pretty. Next, we have, we're calling this um, smoke blue. Yep. Now, this is, you can see it next to the turquoise, so you can see the difference. Mm -hmm. It's like, this is the pale blue, this is the smoke blue. And then we have the bark. This is really on trend hmm. right now. People are using these neutrals, bark, and this is the gray. Oh, well, everybody has been decorating with gray. It is my most limited choice, of course. Um, but I like it because so many grays can be very flat and kind of lifeless. Yes. And this has some, some beef and body to it and a luminosity almost. You know why? Because we added this plaid jacquard. It's woven into the material and it's color on color. So let's say if you have floral wallpaper. Okay. Plaid works great with that. Mm. Let's say you have a bathroom that's just, you know, off white or something. Mm -hmm. Little splash of color because it's such a big canvas, your shower curtain. Why not make it interesting? Make it fresh. I have to tell you, I have this bathroom. It's maroon. Mm, okay? okay. And I wanted mm -hmm. to get it all ripped out. And it was $8,000. Oh, so I said, I'm yeah. going to go with the gray <laughs> and some new towels. And I'm like, voila, brand new bathroom. Boom. Um, yeah. I mean, really, because for $22 for the shower curtain, which takes up the biggest real estate it in does. the entire bathroom, it can have major effect. Couple of bucks for some towels. We have some great towels here from Home Reflections on QVC.com. Love them. Boom. You might yes. be less than $100 and you just gave your, your bathroom a makeover. A whole new look. And it looks so fresh. And even if you have a smaller... Um, like a stall like this. This is about a three foot stall. It works beautifully. So if you have more than one bathroom, why not do both? Freshen them up for the springtime. You know, a lot of times too, I, I do, um, I prep houses for sale. Uh -huh. And I always put up a fresh shower curtain. And the clients always say, why didn't I do that sooner? It looks so good. <laughs> and I'm like, I know. And, and they love that this is the hookless. And Stacy, this is the, the shower curtain. If you go to a hotel, this is what they're using it. because it's easy to put up, easy to take down, easy to clean. Easy to clean. Yeah. Because we're throwing all of it 
in the washing machine, yeah. liner and all. Well, you could, yeah, you could do that, or you could even just wipe the liner clean. It's up to you. Okay. But um, and this is waterproof. The shower curtain is water resistant, so it's really it's a combination of all three in one purchase. Yeah. And it looks so good. Yeah, it does. It's 71 by 74 inches, so it, it, it fits standard shower stalls. Um, and it just is just that really pop of elegance, too. And I like when um, with the jacquard print and the plaid, it could be it could be traditional. It could be contemporary, too, depending on what or True. modern, what your decor is. A lot of designers use the plaid. It's it's iconic with a lot of designers now, that we know. what colors would you put with this? If you were going to like pick your towels, um, what would you coordinate with this color? Okay, Which I even like bark. this color that I'm wearing, like a watermelon towel mm. for a pop of colors for the spring. Okay. So uh, this is a great idea. If you want to be more classic, classic white towels always look beautiful. A wh you would go with white instead of ivory? Um, sure. You know yeah, what it is? See, what? If, if my if my tub is white, uh -huh. I would do white. If okay. my tub was in the ivory family, I would do see, the this ivory. This is why we bring in the experts yeah. because I wouldn't have thought of that. Yeah. You know, that you match the, the porcelain that's in there. Like I said, like this right here mm -hmm. is like in the ivory family. See how the yellow works better against it? So and again, we, with our brown too, I think it works beautifully with that as well. But if you want to do white towels, you could do that too. Maybe you have yeah. people coming over to visit this summer on vacation. Maybe you're gonna, you know, you're gonna have a new baby, and then you're gonna have your mother-in-law staying with you for a while. She, <laughs> she has that guest bathroom at Seen Better Days. Guess what? Spruce it up. Get it a brand new shower curtain. Give it a new look. All you have to do is spend twenty-two dollars, and you don't have to buy anything. This is it. You get it all. Hook liner and curtain machine washable in that plaid jacquard pattern. I love this spray. It is Limited though. All right, Jane, thank you so much. Thank you, my friend. Good to see you. You too.